All right, so you guys may remember about a year or so ago, I did a video of the vacant apartment down here. This portion is like what's been converted to the apartment and then the rest of the basement is this small area over here. Um, yeah, this is the light that I painted off white. I'm gonna be using that for a fan. That's coming then we can test. But um, they've already started doing some work to it. One of which is they actually replaced the white here. I didn't know, I knew they were working in there, but I did not know they were placing one that was out here. Kind of things that they got rid of that antique one that was there, but it wasn't in the, be the best shape. And also there's other ones up in here at least. But at least I have two whites that can work here now, so. Yeah. Something that they did is they swapped out all the old light sockets, the light switches and the plugs, the outlets, which all of them were out of code. And that uh, square shaped white that was here is gone. <clears throat> but yeah, you can really see how contaminated this place was with nicotine and everything. But, um, yep, there's a new switch here. The bathroom's been completely gutted. Kind of sad to see it gutted. It was just like the one upstairs. It's different, the same exact tiling, but it was in really, really nasty shape. So I really don't blame them for gutting it completely. But, um, yep, there's that. Here's some, they put one of these lights here. They have two. They have like three of these. So I'm guessing they might be. Six of these, so there's one here. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah. Now I know where the six one is. Put a new one here. And the one that was here originally was broken, but I was going to switch. Then this one here. All the cabinets are gone. The washing machine's gone. Switched out too. And now for the back hallway, which I never liked going through originally, but now that's working too. So, because the place is not, is now disinfected, I'm gonna be using this space kind of, in a, little by little, using it to pass the empty boxes that I need to recycle for here instead of going all, all the way upstairs making a big lap around the building just to recycle the stuff. But I figured I'd just show it now, just how it is. I'm gonna show it step by step, what they're gonna do with it. I really hope they didn't, I already know they're gonna make it into a new apartment, but I figured I might as well show you guys the process. But, um, hmm, would've been cool if they put a fan here, but I'm not gonna sacrifice one of my fans to put here, it's not worth it. Yeah, I'm gonna have a new neighbor basically, but so I may have to clear out some space in this basement. Or I can just move some of it to the other basement. Which I really don't wanna do, but it might have to happen. But I really am curious to see how this turns out though, because you know, let me show this portion again. See, it's really not in the best shape. It definitely needs a lot of work. But they've been doing it really slowly, so that might who knows if it'll even be finished by the time I move out of here, which will be in another few years or so. But yeah, but I actually, but yeah, that's something I have been doing. It's kind of using this space as like a storage area for the boxes and to get out of the basement so that way the basement's not too crowded. Because with the coronavirus issue going on, um, there's a lot of, I'm using this time to get rid of a lot of stuff. Sneak peek of what it is. That's only sneak peek, sneak peek you're gonna get something of possible. 
Blanca. But um, yeah, I've just been working on the basement area, while clearing it out as much as I can. Cause it's definitely starting to get a bit overflowed with the boxes here and such. But um, yeah, that's. <clears throat> I just keep these boxes here though because and there's a reason for that. For these holes, hear that? Well, the other side of the basement, and I need to seal those off. But in the meantime, I'm just using the boxes to kind of block off the hole so that way humidity doesn't get in here. But, um, <clears throat> yeah. And in the meantime, since now all my courses have been canceled for the rest of the semester and everything's been moved online, that gives me more time to work down here and everything else. So, since I won't be as tired being on campus all day, I'll be at home instead. But, when they put another one of these type of shelves here. It probably should come out to here at most. I may have to get one that's a little bit small, I'm not sure yet. But if I do end up having to get one that's a bit small, I'll just put another one like this, where that one over there is. Okay, that one's kind of a flimsy one. I kind of rather get rid of that and put something more sturdy over there. If it ends up being too big, I just want to see how it clears out. I might, it might, I might have to do like one bigger one here than a smaller one further down. But we'll see. Just this one here. It's just complete garbage. It's like it's holding the passport two box from that was it that was in my kitchen, but um, yeah, there's this mess you see here. Some fans from upstairs. Yeah, it's gotten messy. <laughs> Not proud of it, but with college I kinda neglect I just and tossing stuff down here kind of and kind of got a bit far but that's being worked on um yeah so I kind of I think I'll just do a little bit of update of the basement the work in progress I don't see how this point might have to start eating in the basement if you don't want to but whatever I put over there is more the unvaluable stuff so, um, yeah, that'll be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more videos to come.